guys and I know I know it's been a really really long time since I uploaded I suck at keeping up with this channel but the world has gotten topsy-turvy we got coronavirus and then quarantine so travel has literally been the last thing that I could possibly do but after a long stint of unemployment I resubscribed to snack crate so at least we can do this I also did a poll on my Instagram on what kind of video I should do so that will be my next upload maybe like a week from whenever you're seeing this um, and then we can kind of get back on track with some ideas to just keep the channel going and not at a standstill just because of quarantine so snack crate of the month we're gonna figure out where it's from, but what I never mentioned before is that they actually give you a hint, kind of, on the the packing label. So if you look at it, I blocked out my address. Um, before your name, it'll say like Miss or Mister in whatever language of the country that the box is from. So I think this is Chinese, China? Which should be interesting because I literally only get one thing when I get Chinese takeout. So let's open it up and see if I'm correct. We had um, the Philippines before. That was the closest Asian country we had. Although I didn't film that for the channel. Sorry. Oh, just kidding. It's Korea. Yeah. That's our box of the month. It's so cute. Isn't it like cherry blossom season soon too? Okay, as always they have a little booklet of what's some facts about the country and stuff like that. So this is specifically South Korea. Um then you have your little booklet of what's in your box and what it is the things that are in it but we don't do that because it's fun to guess and um for some reason there's like colored paper in here like little squares of different color i don't know why maybe this is like a, a tradition of theirs i have no idea hi future crystal here so the paper was actually for like this little craft thing that came with the box. I didn't read through all the paper when I did the video because I get too excited about the snacks. But they gave you like four sheets of paper and instructions on how to do something similar to origami. So that's why the colored papers were in there. Okay, back to the video. the crap out of me <laughs> they have like their usual advertisement in the box so on the flip side it says the stacks are expired and then it says just kidding they aren't but you might think that if you don't pay close attention to the date for it back because for some reason including you know metrics we use a different date system than the rest of the world that is wicked I was so scared okay moving on <laughs> I don't I'm wondering if this came in my boxes before and I just never noticed. This is a very long intro. Then you got your paper with your nice little sticker right there. So we're gonna dig in. We're just gonna go for it. Okay, one of these I know already right off the bat. Because we have something similar here in the US or maybe I've just tried it in a different stack, great. Right? I don't know. This is the opening. There's like some chip looking things, a couple of sweets, and of course there's more underneath it. I forgot my water. I'll be right back. Okay, I got my water. <laughs> Ugh. I miss this. I recently moved back to New York. Poland Spring has been like my favorite thing so far. And the cold, because I'm weird like that. We're gonna start with whatever this is. I don't read Korean, so I can't even tell you what that says. Um, and the entire 
back of it is also in Korean. So I may actually have to use this guy if I'm truly clueless because... <laughs> okay. It looks like it has like seeds on it and there's like a honeycomb looking thing right here. So, crown. I don't know, let's just try. It's been so long. Like, I really miss doing these videos. But now I can't do it like with my mom or my dad because they're in a different state. That does not smell nice. What is this? Oh, it kind of looks like um those like crispy things they might give you for wonton soup. Not this in my lap. Can you not get in the back? That's my water. You have your own fountain. Go, go. It smells kind of sweet. I don't think I'm gonna like this, but okay. It is sweet. I can't figure out what it is. called Magu Magu. Oh, it doesn't tell me what it is. <laughs> it just says that it's crunchy, sweet snack. Okay. Um, we can move on without it. It's fine. Next, I'm going to try something I know I will like. A little choco pie with marshmallow filling. I'm a sucker for marshmallow and not straight out of the bag. It's got to be Roasted, toasted, or burnt. Ooh. It's a little, you know. It's it's a moon pie. It's a Korean moon pie. That's what it is. Hmm. Are moon pies soft? So soft. I always thought moon pies had like a little crunch to them. Now I'm second guessing everything I know about moon pies. Tala, is it moon pie soft? Moving right along. This is a cream cake, spongy soft cakes filled with rich custard cream. I like custard in some like pastries and stuff, like fish fingers and custard. No, thank you. Oh, it smells. Wait. I was gonna say it smells good, but then no, it smells good. Does it smell good? I don't know. It smells kind of like um a, a a Twinkie. It smells like a Twinkie. We're doing fine. I'm fine. You're fine. You're comfortable at home or wherever you're watching this. YouTube is everywhere. We're gonna try. Ooh, it's a uh, English. It's a jelly. It's a gummy. It literally says it on the package, but I had a moment trying to figure out what it is. Oh wow, I smelled it as soon as it tore it open. <gasps> Ooh, now it's strong. You guys know the Welch's grape juice? It feels like that. But as soon as you open it, whoa, grape. Are they all grape? Oh, they are. Oh, it's a little grape! How cute is that? It's tough. I've been craving gummy bears too, so this is good. But 
I don't like that it's all great. Can mix it up a little. All right, we finally have a winner. Oh, a noodle snack. Don't, don't boil it, smash it with my hands. <laughs> Is this just dry ramen noodles? Oh, but that's fun. Oh wait, now I'm just gonna have crumbs. Oh no. There's instructions and I did it wrong. I was supposed to open it, take out the spices, and then smash, and then add the spices. Okay, is this gonna be spicy? It, this is just ramen with no water. This is, um, what is it called? Bulgogi flavor, which I don't know what that is. Oh. noodle. Do you want me to eat? I know. This tastes very familiar. Wait, it smells like barbecue chips. I don't really eat barbecue chips. Well, yeah. It's barbecue. There's so much flavor. Not flavor, just it's like a powdery thing. If it's not mixed well, you get too much powder on one thing and it's not a fun time. <laughs> There's a little cookie. Aw, that's so cute. It says <laughs> Margaret cookie with parents love. I don't even know if I can make it so you can see that. Oh. Oh, that's kind of weird, but it looks cute. It's like a bun. Surprise, I like all the sweet stuff. It's actually really good. I can't really decipher what kind of cookie it is. <clears throat> it's not even on here. Hey! Snack Crate knows me by now. They're like, you don't need a description. You never look at it. Next we have... Something tiramisu. A cookie or like a flat cake with tiramisu flavor. What is this? Oh, it's a cookie. It's a, I, I kind of broke it, but it's a cookie. Oh, it's so soft. Ooh. I'm going to try with this bit right here. <laughs> Only things I've liked, like legitimately liked, have been sweet. The charcoal pie, tiramisu cookie, the parents love cookie, and the, the grape jellies. Have a good time with the butter waffles of Crown. Butter waffles? Same thing, <laughs> just backwards. Can you see it? <laughs> mm -hmm. I 
actually tastes like a squished um, waffle. <laughs> We've only got four snacks left. And I see something that I think I'm gonna really like, so I'm gonna save that for last. And I'm gonna try, oh no, something sour. See that face? That's what I'm about to do. There's like this little tab here that says to pull it. Did I do it wrong? Am I stupid? Yes, I am. <laughs> oh, it's kind of like now or laters. And a little package, an individual. There's more than one of these. <laughs> yep, that's lemon. I'm the kind of person that likes the yellow and orange starburst more than the pink and the red ones. So if this isn't that sour, I might like it. Mm. Oh no. Oh no, it's in the middle. It's got a tinge <laughs> of sour. Like, like if you lick the inside of a lemon, like that. But it has the texture of a starburst. So I will finish them. <laughs> They're pretty good. This is this weird but this has no lettering on it. Everything Snack Crate has sent me has had like a, a package. Like this looks like someone just is selling them on the street. Which I guess, you know, is included as a snack, but yeah, I just want to make a piece of it. Piece of it, piece. Oh, it's sticky. Oh, ew, what is this? And it looks like popcorn? The little bits of popcorn at the bottom of the bag of the beer. It is popcorn. I can't tell what's in the middle though. It's very bland. It, it's kind of like a popcorn rice cake. That's exactly what I think when I see this and when I taste it. And it's very soft. Like, it's not hard. It's weird. I don't know about that one. Alright, second to last treat is... I don't know. kind of looks like a, a Pocky ordeal, but... I don't know. Wait, am I opening this right? You see... I'm not. Look, I was opening it from the top like a barbarian. And there's a little boop here to press in. Oh. And peel. I'm a fan of this easy packaging you guys got going on. Savory pocket. Mm. It tastes smoky. <laughs> it's not bad. It just tastes smoky. Our last treat of the day a pocky look-alike that has white chocolate on it i'm so excited to try this and it's line friends which i think is part of whatsapp like its own game i was about to do it again i was about to tear this off 
<clears throat> when it says open right here in English. Really just a barbarian when it comes to these snacks. Ooh, these look good. Look at that. It's like, it's white chocolate and chocolate cookie, like an Oreo. Every time a snack crate comes and there's like an Oreo looking thing in it, that's immediately my favorite snack. This is delicious. Oh my god. Mm. It's only 160 calories apparently. One serving per container. The whole thing is 160 calories. Um, that is our snack crate for today. We had South Korea. It was a roller coaster of emotions for me because sour and weird sweet treats and regular sweet treats and just an all around great experience. If you are not subscribed to Snack Crate, you really should be. Um, especially if you'd like to travel and have the kind of job that doesn't let you do it all the time. Um, this video is not sponsored, but I'm a big fan of Snack Crate. These videos are really fun to film, your reactions are fun to read, and it's just a really good way to experience the world without leaving home. Like whoever came up with this idea, you nailed it. That is all for today. Please leave a like if you like the video, comment, subscribe, ring the bell, you know the drill, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.